sorting your personal needs please hear me for some of you while I described the human body I perhaps call systems that are physically failing in your own body while it was an analogy to explain the kingdom systems for victory for some of you you were just wondering and saying apostle is just calling this thing anything that has entered your body and has vowed to cut short your life i command it must jump out of your body now it must jump out of your body now it must jump out of your systems out of your organs now in the name of jesus hallelujah i'm going to speak over your finances if you don't need it you can receive it for someone else but i want to pray over your finances there is an advantage we have in addition to our value our wisdom relationships there is the grace of god that engenders favor you find that in second corinthians chapter 9 and verse 8 i like how the bible puts it it says and god is able to make all grace not some grace all grace are bound towards you that ye always having all sufficiency sufficiency means the capacity to always rise to the occasion never disappointing in all things it says may abound to every good work i decree and declare in the name of jesus the son of the living god for someone here regardless the financial mountains that stand before you i call upon my god who is also your god let things begin to change supernaturally open financial doors 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 in the name of jesus christ it says the lord is my shepherd i shall not want i decree and declare whatever makes resources to go out of your hands whether is the careless use of them or a demonic manipulation whatever be the case i decree and declare the grace to retain resources receive it now are you ready for favor I will pray this one today I will pray that the miracle service next week I will continue to pray till you become a living expression of the favor of God let me pray it for you what is in favor huh. favor has the ability to accelerate your life and your destiny favor has the supernatural ability to bring to end seasons of hardship seasons of all kinds of things most people have not understood the also passing excellency of carrying the genuine grace for favor and i have told you the proof of favor is not money money is the least thing you can be given as a result of favor the proof of favor is when god connects you to the hearts of men that you call on one man and a nation is ready to respond to you and even to attend to your needs i don't know who that person is but i'm stretching my hands towards you that grace i lay my hands on my own head and i pray by the privilege of the election of grace may that grace rest upon you may that grace rest upon you rest upon you rest upon you this grace called favor let it rest upon you let it rest upon you in the city in the country let it rest upon you in the name of jesus christ that you become a living evidence of what god can do with men in the name of jesus christ and by this impartation of favor I call forth whoever has been mandated by God to participate in your rising. 
whether you know them or not I declare this week by the power that raised Christ from the dead may they show up in your life may they show up in your life in the name of Jesus Christ hear me final prayer whatever has refused to move forward you have moved it by your energy you have moved it intellectually you have outsourced men to move it but it has refused to move i stand by the 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 advantage of the prophetic i move you forward i move you forward make constructive progress in the name of jesus christ For in Jesus' name we pray. You have believed it. Your eyes will see it. Your hands will handle it. I say it again. Your eyes will see it. And your hands will handle it. In Jesus' name we pray. Now listen to me please. Essentially, there are two principal ways God channels his blessings to the saints. Listen, please. We have a series on that coming. But I want you to listen. Number one, the works of your hands. The first way that God channels resources to come to you is through the works of your hands. Whatever it is you are doing, preaching, singing, business, your job. Number two, relationships. These are the two principal channels by which God communicates his resources to the saints. Let me repeat the works of your hands. Number two, relationships. When God wants to accelerate your becoming, he sends both. He empowers the works of your hands and then connects you with strategic relationships. There are many people who have great ideas that they should not even be crying for rent. But the relationships that will help them. Remember John chapter 5. I have no man when the waters is there to put me there. I'm praying for you one more time. If you have the faith to receive. The relationship that must be introduced to your life. Before the end of February. In fact before the miracle service. I pray for you this week. May you encounter those helpers. this week may you encounter those helpers can I tell you and I say this with every sense of humility there is nothing I have cried about in my life that God did not raise a man to hear me I pray for you the days of crying alone without help without help us those days come to an end now